Welcome back to The Breakdown. Today we're reviewing the sleep mask with Bluetooth built-in speakers here to connect to your phone, allow you to listen to music, podcasts, radio, whatever you want through your sleep mask as you sleep without disturbing your partner. This is great, I love it. My wife likes to watch TV, which is fine sometimes for me, but often I like to listen to the radio, a podcast and the like as I fall asleep. This allows me to do it without disturbing her, without her hearing it. And it's a very comfortable way to black out the light and everything around you. So we're gonna do a full review of this, give you my opinion of them, talk about a few of the features, a few things I really like, a couple things I wish were a little different, and give you my thoughts on it. First though, if you wanna learn more about this product, I will put a link to it uh, on Amazon in the show notes down below and in the first comment. And if you're new here, do me a big favor, help this channel grow by hitting that subscribe button, hitting that thumbs up. It really does help because it lets YouTube know you enjoy what we do here and hopefully we can help you Find out not just about this product, but so many other things. All right, the sleep mask is a pretty standard sleep mask. It is a very nice padded mask. So on the inside, you've got nice pad with recessed eye holes here. So if you're like me and you don't really like the feel of your um, eyelashes smashed against your face, there is little holes here to help with that. Very nice um, padded area here to help make sure that around your nose, no light is seeping through and very comfortable padding on it. Very soft, almost velvety kind of feeling fabric on it, which is pretty nice with it. Now on the front here, uh, come on, focus, there we go. There are three buttons. You do have the ability to, of course, set up pairing, pause, play, volume up and down. Now I will say these buttons are a little difficult to uh, feel when you're wearing your face mask. After a while, you kind of get used to where they are. But honestly, if I'm just adjusting the volume, I'll often just reach over my nightstand, grab my phone, and I find I can change the volume there better blindfolded than trying to use these buttons. Though the play button, pause button is pretty nice. There is a minor bit of raised feel to it, but overall it's a very smooth feel. I kind of wish that these were a little bit thicker buttons on it. Past that though, very easy, very comfortable to wear. Now the ear um, speakers, these are the really cool things here. These are speakers that allow you to hear audio right through it. These are actually adjustable. So there's this big area here where you can slide these speakers up and down to perfectly place it over your ears, which is very nice. We're all very different. And the ability that you can actually adjust this works really well. And I really like it, very comfortable. On the back, there is a Velcro strap here to adjust to your head. And it's also um, spandexy kind of elastic um, strap here to help a very snug, but not overly tight fit to make sleeping in very, very comfortable. Now it does charge through micro USB, which is fine. Kind of wish it was USB-C because pretty much everything I have now has moved over to USB-C, but micro USB is a very easy charge on it. Now it takes a little over two hours of full charge and it gets about eight hours of charge on it. Honestly, how I find it works, I go to bed, I fall asleep, and by the time I'm in the morning, it's batteries run out. So probably eight hours is a slightly aggressive um, option there. I would say though, I've never had it when I'm laying in bed, even for a couple hours listening to a podcast, just kind of thinking uh, my brain wander. I don't know if I'm the only one that sometimes has a hard time falling asleep. I've never had a problem with battery power on this. And since it's a blindfold, it's not like I'm gonna be wearing this around the house to listen to audio all the time. So I find that pretty nice. Now, the speakers are kind of hard in the side here, but the ability to adjust them perfectly over my ears makes it a very comfortable fit. Even when I'm side sleeping with my head on the pillow, I don't find it discomforting to have the hard speakers on the side because it lines up perfectly with my ear very comfortably. I would say this can easily fit everything from a child all the way through adult because of these adjustable straps. You can go very wide, you can go very small with them and have them very comfortable to wear and to fit. I really enjoy the padded um, facial part here where it fits perfectly over my eyes and I don't feel like I have a hard mask just plastered on my eyeball. I feel like there's air and room, but I'm not seeing any light. I wouldn't say these are the best blackout um, ones, but I would say these are probably one of the better blackout blindfolds if you are very important to not see light. I would say it's a very good one I wouldn't say it's the best. It's not like it's you know, suctioned to my face so hard that no light will ever come in, which I actually kind of like. It's not over aggressive, which means that I can easily wear it and sleep in it very comfortably. So there you go. If you want to find out more about the sleep mask with Bluetooth speakers, 
included. Link in the show notes down below to Amazon. If you like this video, do me a big favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, it really does help us. As we're doing a lot more reviews like this and so many other types of videos about big things happening around the world, I would appreciate your support as we grow this new channel and help us hit our goal of 5,000 subscribers next month. So thank you for your support, I really appreciate it. We'll be back with another video real soon. Take care everybody, be safe.